Hey guys, welcome back. So I'm going to be working on the other side of the counterbalance and basically duplicating what I did on um, the first side. Now this is a little bit more tricky for me because instead of having a straight edge, what I have is a contoured, uh, a bent uh, part of the counterbalance. So um, this original platform came off of a sickle mower and I decided to repurpose it and make this counterbalance out of it. And um, it has done a really good job. It's a very strong structure. I'm very impressed with it. But basically what I want to do is create a straight edge um, coming from here, straight across, and then going in. And I want to make, make it where these, these removable baskets are symmetrical and can be interchanged. I don't want to have to always think, well, which side does this go on? I want to be able to swap them out. And so what I have done, I have went ahead and took a measurement. I need to measure about 15 inches, 14, about, actually about 14 and a quarter um, from this, um, from the three-point hitch, one of the connectors here. I need to come back about that far. I've already marked a spot that I'll be working from. And so now we know that we need to come out from this spot here. And it looks like we need a piece that's four and a quarter inches long. So what I'm doing now is using the box I've already built as sort of a jig. So I've got this set up, I've leveled it. Actually I want the outside elevated a little bit more than the inside because once I um, have this resting on the pins that I'm installing, then this is going to sag just a little bit. So this side's a little bit elevated, I've, I have everything in place, I have everything leveled. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and... Um, Go ahead and get the right side, get the right length, about uh, 20 inches, and then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, weld these on.
So to build my basket, I'm going to be using this part, uh, this, this scrap steel. This was part of the um, framing that came with my uh, Winmax wood chipper. I've got the frame for the second box uh, welded together and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and set this up and um, since these bars are identical to the opposite side I'm going to use this as a jig and I'm going to go ahead and um, weld these bars to, to this um, box. got the box welded together. This thing went together a lot easier than the last one because of the uh, I had some pieces already welded together from the uh, last frame that I cut apart. But what I just want to say is this is really a nice box. I'm very pleased with the way this went together. So what I want to do now is sand this down and then I'm going to um, go ahead and paint it.
do, make this, the handle's fairly standard. We'll go down two inches, over four. So there's four. And then down two. Here you go. Down two, down two, over four. Got it? Mm-hmm. All right, what center, what's the measurement? Uh, 18 and a half. You said 18 and a half? Mm-hmm. What's half 18 and a half? Nine All right. and a quarter. Yep. Make sure that edge is flush up against the board. Okay, nice job.